Moin Moin! Welcome to another of my World of Tanks videos. And this is going to be another attendant to my uh, kind of series of how to play RT and not be an asshole. Now, I'm playing RT a bit more recently because to get those damn missions done and to get those tanks, it's actually pretty useful to have RTs that can complete the missions, so I'm grinding them a bit. But I'll spare you the, the boredom of a long RT battle and basically just give a kind of a super cut of the hits uh, till the interesting part starts. <laughs> Looks like I hit the UI and splashed the tiger with it. I don't think this guy's a huge fan of me. Here we go. And that was a hit. I had seen somebody camping here, and that was probably a hit. That was a good battle for me to this point, but not so much for the team. <laughs> and, um, now we reached the time where you can decide if you're a scumbag when playing Artie, or if you're a man. And it's nice to see that all Arties decided to fight. So that will now be an interesting battle. And there is the first attacker of our last stand position, but our Hummel takes care of him. And this is definitely not any more of the time for a top-down view on the map, but to figure out what's possible. Unfortunately, every time we get spotted, there is arty shells raining down on us, and there's the next contester who pressures us. And one thing that's nice about Arties, you can actually shoot across obstacles, even if the enemy is way too close for comfort. So I'm in a semi here looking very, very cautiously for a shot uh, in the hope not to get spotted doing it. Unfortunately, I can't quite figure it out before the SU gets down. But well, at least we avenge him immediately. I hit him and the Hummel takes care of him. <laughs> but no time, as the next tank appears behind me. Uh, not certain why I was. Well, the Jackson couldn't spot me. Maybe that guy was around the corner or was still double bushed. And um, let's see what I can do about him. And you can switch, see me switching to a uh, top down view here. That's really useful if enemies are behind obstacles. Because then it's actually sometimes better to, to guess where you have to aim. You can way better aim like beyond targets. And I'll immediately switch for the bigger threat, and that's definitely the TD. Um, at 25 TP, didn't look like a particularly good player, and it's definitely not a particularly scary tank. So I decided for the uh, SU. And there's the rain of arty shells incoming. <laughs> Barely dodged the three of them. Uh, last was probably the uh, Lefer, Lefer, Lefer. Otherwise, uh, I probably would have heard a lot more. What am I going to do next? Um, problem is that today is coming. Um, each time he spots the Jackson gets hammered by arty. So I kind of hope to uh, either use the distraction or um, at least uh, be a distraction myself that the Jackson can maybe finish him off. So I'll try to sneak around here, use that bush as cover to sneak upon him. And there's the opening. I dunk the shot, but again, the humble doesn't. So uh, we're still in the party. Unfortunately, it's now two RTs versus three. <laughs> That's definitely interesting situation. And ooh, look at that. 
There is the enemy AMX. And he is... He is smart. He's a good guy as well. Uh, kudos to him. He, because he goes scouting in the uh, French RT. And I've done that in the tier 4 to 6. French RTs myself when I grinded them long ago. They make surprisingly good scouts. Because they're rather fast. And rather sneaky. Unfortunately for the Hummel that played very well. Um, the scouting part works actually pretty well. I hope that the AMX would push forward and I could uh, get his sight. But that didn't work. And the Hummel is taken out. So there is no more time for tactics. Only for close quarter action. Unfortunately, I was running a bit out of time at this point and couldn't find the third one uh, to shotgun him as well. Quite a shame. And what I also learned. There is no Pascucci's medal for Arties. I demand a shotgun medal.